This is Vern Bang, recipe slang and muck banging it out. Not a pro or a hoe. We're going to be banging it out in this episode. Chisel and nizzle. Wigtastic, it's magic. Spilling the tea on some of them episodes. It's your boy, Vern Bang. And that's why cooking from my soul is the way I go on this multiple mukbang channel. We'll be back for more episodes. How's it going? So anyway, y'all, this is Vern Bang. We're back with another episode. So, Lord Jesus, thank you for the stay. Thank you for everything you do in our life, Lord. I just want to pray for this food. That you provided for us, Lord, in the hands of the prepared it. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for everybody. And as we we'll pray for everybody in the whole wide world. You see land, you know their needs, you know their hearts. You know anybody that's sick and needs a little extra, 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 extra prayer, Lord. Just put that power protection over them. And any extra needs, Lord, you know. Get our you know what we need to do, or that little extra, extra things we need to do. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen, honey. Amen, amen, amen. Put that extra power. So yes, y'all. We're doing an awesome video today. So, I got uh, a five meat Stuffed crust pizza by Papa Murphy's. Uh, now, I'm not sure if I've done Papa Murphy's on this channel before. I might have, I might not have, but... Anyways, we're going to do this Mediterranean salad. So... That's for sure. So let's get a little, I'm trying to make it look pretty. Oh yeah, and it's got sun-dried tomatoes, olives, yeah, spinach, feta, you know, the usual suspects. And of course, So good. So I'm going to do this jalapeno ranch. And there's one thing I'm going to say about Papa Murphy. Is this good? 99.9% of the time. Because the pizza is always good. But you take it home. And honey, you got to bake it in your own oven. So you buy this raw, put together, you bring it home, you bake it in your oven, that's the concept. Now their salads are pretty, really good. But well, honey, when I get a salad this big for five bucks, that's a good deal, right? But when you give me one packet of damn dressing and one packet of damn croutons. Now, I might like ranch. I might like a thousand islands. But shouldn't you give everybody like, a you know. Oh, but we'll just put all the sauces in there in case. Or how many sauces do you like? Or... If I order a family side of this, you think I'm going to eat all this out by myself? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. That's the only thing I could. I got one little pack of dressings for one person. And one crouton. For one person. Oh, 
Come on, Papa Murphy. And of course, I paid fifteen ninety nine for the pizza. So. And the salad is wonderful. But yeah, just getting this pizza, so. Let me get you an up glass. Pepperoni, Italian sausage, Canadian bacon, bacon, and beef. So beef, so beef. Italian sausage, bacon, pepperoni, and Canadian bacon. And I got the garlic sauce. How do I have the garlic sauce? Or do they next time I'm going to put extra, extra garlic sauce? Five. Or do their garlic sauce that they do and then have extra garlic sauce on the side. Mm. So yeah. I mean this is so good. Hopefully y'all can see it. Hanging off a little bit. There we go. And don't get me wrong. Don't get me twisted. I get salads there because their salads are good. But I'm like, really? One crouton, one dressing for four or five people? But even if it's three people, fool, it doesn't matter. You don't know. You should be getting more. No need to all be, I don't know. And normally I ask for more. But the last few times, well, it's been a year since I've been here, so. Now I know the protocol training for the last time I went. They gave me like four or five. <laughs> I was like, damn. All right. This time I was like, really? But anyway, enough about me and my pizza. How are you doing, honey? How are you doing? Have you tried this jalapeno ranch yet? Hopefully you have. Or jalapeno bacon ranch. And have you tried Papa Murphy's? Let me know in the comments. Which the one concept I love about this, you take it home and bake it. Which is awesome. Because it's ready when you want it to be ready. And the salad is yummy. I just know next time I'm going to ask for extra everything. And 
if you're watching a Papa Murphy. Yeah. This changes one crouton and one uh, dressing per giant salad protocol. Okay. Oh. Okay. <laughs> But this piece is money, especially with the garlic sauce. It normally comes with the red sauce, but Daddy don't do red sauce unless it's owned strictly uh, all we got pasta. And I don't even mind the red sauce then because. I don't cook it to death. Yes. This is so good. Yeah. Black olives, everything. So, so good. Let me see how much time I have left before. <laughs> I don't hear it click off. Alright, we're about 13 minutes. <laughs> Hope you like the background. It looks cute. Hopefully you ain't been doing the flashy number like I've been doing here lately. So I'm like, really? What is up with that flashy number? I have no idea. Mm. And one other thing that gets me about every pizza place I get. I always ask for garlic sauce or some type of out white Alfredo sauce. And without fail, they always fuck up or mess up, sorry, my order. Like, they had to remake this pizza because he did the wrong sauce on it. Because it normally comes with red sauce. I went to Pizza Hut. I did an online order at Pizza Hut. They put the wrong toppings on the wrong sauce. A year ago, I went here. Got the same pizza. Guess what? They had to make it twice. It's like... What is the deal? It's like... If I ask for white sauce, how in the hell are they messing up the day? We're going to take a drink of vodka and coke. Mmm. Ooh! So good and so refreshing. Yes, she is. Mmm. Mmm. Let me tell you. You ain't gonna try to pop Marvies and you got one in your neighborhood? Try one, honey. It's good. Mm. 
The sun-dried tomatoes are really good. Mm. Black olives. Feta cheese. Mmm. Mmm. So yummy and delicious. I already know you ain't something good with me. Let me know in the comments what you eat with me. Hmm. And definitely may even know if you ever try Papa Murphy's. I don't know if they're everywhere or Texas only. I have no idea. Not real sure. I don't know it's like a pre non cooked pizza that you bring home and you cook it at the house. Of course the salads you don't have to cook. <laughs> the That's probably a given. <laughs> but this is <isn't> gay. <laughs> oh, Tasty. Super tasty. Okay. And I like the texture of the dough. It's like soft, springy. Not gonna kill your teeth. I mean, you got all the stuff meat in between it. Ugh. Yeah, we know we love our stuff and meat. Mm. Yes, yeah, so. sir. so good. It's so good. So refreshing. It's such a good salad. It's a clean, easy meal to eat. Let me get up and see how much time I got. Hey, but honey, you know I've been losing time all day long. Time's gonna be going by so quickly. Well, we good.
for probably about like eight minutes. And so, might as well do a little dessert. So yes, I broke down today. I was gonna try to eat it on camera, but I could not resist. I could not resist my Russell Stouffer marshmallow bunny and honey. I might have to go look for some more of those because those are good. So we're going to eat the uh, Palmer. And you get these at the Dollar Tree. But you get lots of the Dollar Tree like the Russell Stouffer. We got Dollar Tree. So good. So it looks like this is a white chocolate. Let's see what it says. I'm, well, I'm pretty sure it's a white chocolate. So, high fructose corn sugar, vegetable kernel, <sighs> peanuts, whey. Yeah. So, yeah. Peanuts, milk. If you're allergic, don't be eating this, okay? Oh. Yeah, it's on it. Now. Just stick to your marshmallow bunnies, okay? Not a big fan of that. I'm sure peanut butter is somewhere in there. But it is so... overly sweet that I'm like... I'm gonna give the rest to Mama Bang. I'm sure she'll... knock it up but yeah like I like subtle sweet and that's why I think I like the marshmallow bunny because it's marshmallowy and it's not sweet you get that chocolate you know crunchy shell that marshmallow center but it's not gonna kill you like I took a a little bitty bite and this thing was just I feel like I ate 1,800 Easter bunnies at one time, and I just took one little nibble. That's too sweet, baby. That's too sweet. Mm-mm. Yeah. I may have to go get my little, uh, see a lot of mama out there to clean my mouth up. <laughs> now give me a little dicky. <laughs> I mean, uh, tell one to mama. <laughs> but anyways, y'all, hopefully y'all had a good time today. Hopefully y'all had a blessed day. I know I did. This pizza is money. Matter of fact, mm. I'm going to clean my palate with a little bit more meat. Mm-hmm. I thought I had more meat in there. Mm. Ah, yeah. But stay tuned. We're going to do some more stuff. Um, 
I have no idea what I have planned for tomorrow or the next day. But I guarantee you it's going to be something delicious. So yes, loving you is easy. Peace, stay trail. And you'll be <laughs> Vern Bang, baby. Yes, we're banging it out today, Bobby. Banging it out. And yes, we're going to do some sweet treat tomorrow or the next day that I'm going to have you doing a hook of book. Because I'm just going to gobble it all up. Alrighty, y'all. Love y'all. Stay safe. Don't forget to wash your hands. Don't forget to wear a mask every time you go out. Don't forget. Put that mask on. I know it's a pain in the ass. I know you can't breathe through it. I know it's different. But please, be safe. Protect yourself. Put them gloves on. They're going to help you protect yourself. And... Get that micro band, micro band one in your house, spray everything with, micro band your car. Hell, they need to make that thing like a little keychain. Uh, and if you don't, if they don't ever take that big ass spray micro band 24 hour and just spray it down before you open it if you don't want to wear gloves. But yes, y'all, protect yourself, be safe. And stay healthy. And we're gonna catch you on. Shake it like you baby. Come on and dance with me. Come on. Shake it like you baby. Come on.